What's going on everyone? My name is Jack Southall and I'm here for my WWE Money in the Bank 2015 predictions video uh, where I pretty much, you know, think, who am I gonna, you know what a fucking prediction video is like. Um, anyway, let's talk about all the matches that's gonna be on the card and uh, yeah, let's get right into it. So um, our pre-show match for this pay-per-view tomorrow, it will be R-Troop versus King Barrett. Um, they had like any storyline build at all or, or is it like hey you're a mid card guy you're another mid card guy we can't put you in the money in the bank match so you two face off um yeah i believe that um king barrett's gonna pick up the win i don't see our truth winning this match honestly uh because you know king barrett's been the you know big mean heel and he's got to get a win for this King Barrett gimmick to get over, so yeah, my prediction is King Barrett. Um, then we get to the actual show, we've got the New Day, which will be Biggie and Xavier Woods, because Kofi's going to be in the ladder match, versus the Primetime Players. Um, I'm rooting for the Primetime Players, because I really like them, but New Day, in my opinion, are going to retain, um, because they've won an Extreme Rules, they've been doing very well as a heel team, and I think... They'll, they're gonna, it's gonna be a while until um, primetime players get the tag titles if they even do. So, yeah, my prediction for that is the New Day. Next up, we've got, and uh, that match should be pretty good, the tag match. Uh, next match, we'll talk about uh, the Intercontinental Championship match Ryback versus the Big Show. Oh, God. <laughs> this is gonna be bad, man. This could. This could be one of the worst matches of the year, if they book it wrong. But, you know, I'm gonna um, cross my fingers and hope that um, this is a good match. Because um, they could do it, but just looking on paper, ugh. Just Ryback, this big beefy guy who just won the, the Intercontinental title two weeks ago at the Elimination Chamber um, special. And, you know, he's got to face the big, fat, fucking big show that needs to piss off. But, um, who do I think is going to win? Ryback's got to retain. He, he better retain. So, yeah, Ryback's my pick. Uh, next up, we'll talk about the Divas Championship match. Um, Nikki Bella versus Paige. Um, this could be a pretty good match. Um, I am going with Paige, in my opinion. I think... She needs, Nikki needs to drop the title. I don't want her to go over AJ Lee's um, time as champion, which I think WWE is trying to do so she they can erase her out of the history books. So that means because of her relationship with CM Punk, and yeah, we all know about that. Um, but yeah, I want Paige to win so Nikki Bella does not go longer. Um, but if Nikki Bella wins, I'm not going to be surprised whatsoever. So, um, I'm going to be praying that, um, Paige is going to win, so she's my pick. Um, but I'm probably going to be wrong, so, but who gives a shit. Uh, next up, we'll talk about John Cena versus Kevin Owens. The second match out from these two, and of course, in, um, the last, in the Elimination Chamber, Owens beat Cena. So, I think this is going to me. I think Cena's going to win this. We all know Cena is not going to lose clean twice. That It's not going to happen. If this does happen, it'd be amazing. But there is, uh, it's going to be highly unlikely that he does. So, yeah. And even if Kevin Owens does win, it's going to be in a screwy finish. Because you got to make Cena look strong. You know, he's the face of the company, even though he's holding a mid-card championship. Uh, but, you know, Cena's going to win this. He, he has to win a match. He's not going to lose, you know, every single match to a guy. So, yep, Cena's my pick to win. Next, we've got um, the main match that this pay-per-view sounded around, the Money in the Bank ladder match. In this match, we have the show-off Dolph Ziggler, uh, the new sensation, they're calling him, or I call him the Purple People Eater, uh, Neville, uh, Mr. Cock is Fist, Roman Reigns, uh, the Viper, Randy Orton, 
Um, the New Days, Jumpin' Jacks, Kofi Kingston, uh, the Celtic Warrior Sheamus, and uh, the Corporate Asshole Kane. Ooh, this is a really, really tough one, because um, if Ziggler wins, I'll be fine. Ziggler's not going to win because he's already won. Um, I, I would like to see Neville win. I think that'd be really good. Orton's not going to win it. We all know Kingston's not going to win it. The un Like I've said in previous videos, the only reason he is in this match is so he can do high spots. That's the only reason he's in this match. Oh, watch it. Um, Kane's not going to win, he's already won, but they could give it to him again, oh god. Uh, I don't think Sheamus is going to win either, um, but I'm going to say my pick is Roman Reigns. I feel that Roman Reigns is going to win the Money in the Bank ladder match, because Randy doesn't need it, Kingston's not going to win it, Sheamus doesn't need it, Kane doesn't, but I think it's going to be Reigns or Kane. One of those two are going to win, but I would say Roman Reigns is. He's going to ca cash it in sometime in the near future against Rollins or Ambrose. One of those two. Uh, and he's going to start a feud with them and he's going to continue on his big lineage with the Shield. Um, but speaking, so Roman Reigns is my pick. And speaking of the Shield, his former two um, brothers in that group, well, they're not technically brothers, but you know. Um, will be Seth Rollins versus Dean Ambrose in a ladder match for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Oh my god. <laughs> this oh, this is going to be a show... Actually, show stealer, in my opinion. This is going to be a match of the night. Um, Rollins is very athletic. He can do a lot of great spots. And so can Dean Ambrose because he's a psycho. And he's been st stealing uh, Ambrose... Rollins WWE title and he's been held in it captive so yeah very interesting match who do I think is going to win I believe Rollins is going to retain even though um friggin oh yeah even though friggin Rollins hasn't had the actual title because um Ambrose stole from him but yeah th this is going to be a great match I hope they do something really really crazy just one crazy spot um, I'd like to see Pro the authority will probably get in the way somehow, um, but I believe the winner is going to be Seth Rollins, and it's going to be a great match. Um, other thing, so what are some other matches I see? So uh, I, Money in the Bank ladder match is going to be great. Cena versus Owens can be very, very good as well. So. I, I believe, and you know, the tag match will be probably be pretty good. So this could be a great show, like a really, really great show if they pull out all the stops. So, um, yeah, just wrapping it up, my picks are King Barrett, uh, New Day, Ryback, Paige, John Cena, Roman Reigns, and Seth Rollins. Those are my picks for... Um, Money in the Bank. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Make sure to leave a big fat like if you enjoyed. Um, comment down below who you think is going to win all these matches. And um, if you are, are enjoying my stuff, hit that subscribe button wherever the hell it is. And um, yeah, check me out on Twitter, Instagram at JackmanLoff31. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for the Money in the Bank pay-per-view. I'll be doing a review, of course, for tomorrow's pay-per-view. And I'll see you then. I am out in free. Two, one.